Hey, Brian. Hey, Cap. What's up? So remember when we had that internal hackathon? Yeah, I think so. So from that, one of the plugins that was created is this cool new graph view. But oh, are we are we ready you. to discuss that yet? Yes, we are. I think so. Oh, okay. But All right. I want to show it. So here is the GitHub repo. And in here, it gives you a little GIF of what it's going to look like. And I'll show you in the studio. And we'll come back to how to install it. I really want to show you what it looks like. So I'm going to pull up the sanity.io uh, studio. And in here, if I were to click on graph, it brings up our, give it a second. Our a lot galaxy. of documents to load. <laughs> so this is our galaxy for the sanity.io studio. There's a lot going on here, but let me explain it. So each dot represents a document in our studio. So for example, the blue, and here's our key over here, our post, and orange dots are guides. So, so we have a lot of dots going on, but there's also, I see a lot of lines. What are those connectors meaning there? Yeah, so each line between dots is a reference for those, those two documents. So for example, here's, here's one that has a lot of reference to it. So this light blue dot is, that's Knut. He has a lot of blog posts, a lot of stuff that's referencing him. So it might be a good idea to make sure that document, that author document is kept up to date. And maybe that author is kept up to date too. Yes. Now, another really awesome thing about this is it is real time. So Brian, if you want to join me in the studio. Yeah, let's, let's make a new document around this. So, so if he makes something and it's not referencing anything, where would he show up? There he is. Oh, and there he goes. No, come back. <laughs> I'm floating off into space. So because there's no reference line, it just kind of like floats off into this little asteroid belt that's going on around our galaxy web. And this is all the content that's not being referenced to the main, like to this. Now, if he references something, it brings in that bit of content. And there we go. We see Brian now referencing that gray dot. So a really awesome thing about this feature is that we can see islands of information that need to be referenced mm -hmm. to this whole galaxy web. So we are able to optimize our studio for the correct connectivity between everything. And with that real time, we're able to see everything getting updated as we change things. Now to get this installed into your studio, I'm going to show you the command that you would run within your studio is sanity install graph view. Once you do that, start the studio up again with sanity start, and you will see this graph icon pop up. Click on that and check out what your data set graph view looks like. Now you mentioned your favorite useful feature and being able to identify like all the different connections. But I have to say, my favorite feature is still the useless like UFO flying out into space. I'm gonna fly out in space. Yeah, there. Oh I know. Don't go to the asteroid belt. <laughs> come back into the studio. Bring come, come back. back to our content graph. Fine. I'll come back in. There we go. But yeah, it's super exciting that we can see all this and that maybe it can help you optimize your studio and get it installed using sanity install graph view and see what your data set looks like.